Hi friends, peace be to all. The journey of Lent and Holy Week. We are walking together on a holy journey. We are walking with Jesus on journey to cross. We are walking with Jesus on a journey to Easter. This is the story, our journey. Holy Week. Ash Wednesday is on 17th of February. First Sunday of Lent is on 21st of February. Passion Sunday is on 21st of March. Palm Sunday is on 28th of March. Bondi Thursday is on 1st of April. Good Friday is on 2nd of April. Holy Saturday is on 3rd of April. Easter Sunday is on 4th of April. Like a lamb, Jesus was led to the hill, carrying our sins so that we might have eternal life. So pure, so innocent, yet he was led, born in winter, built wearing more shame. On the cross, Lamb of God, and on the cross, suffering, bearing our guilt by your stripes, we are healed. So pure, so innocent, yet he was led. Born in faith or guilt, wearing your shirt on the cross. Precious blood poured out for us, freeing us, giving us peace. Oh, precious blood, O oh, Lamb of God, so pure, so in. Yet he was led, born in the faith of guilt, wearing your shame on the cross. Brothers and sisters, once again we are entering the beautiful season of Lent. We are reminded once more the 40 days of Jesus' experience in the wilderness, fasting and prayer, and be tempted by the devil, who comes as an angel of light. But Jesus overcame all the temptations. So too, dear brothers and sisters, if we are faithful to our prayers and penances, we will be able to overcome all the temptations which comes in our day-to-day -day lives. Fasting, not only with food, but fasting from all our, from all our sinfulness, shortcoming, our bad habits. There are three things which will cause our faith to stand firm. Our devotion remain constant and virtues endures. They are prayers, fasting, and mercy. Prayer knocks the door, fasting obtains, and mercy receives. So these three are one. We cannot separate, and they give life to each other. Let us offer our souls to God and make Him an oblation of our fasting, so that our souls may be a pure offering a holy sacrifice, a living victims. Let us start our journey towards Calvary by sharing his pains and suffering. He suffers because he loved us. He died that we may have life, life in abundance. Jesus, in his great passion, said, I looked for one to console me, and I found none. Dear brothers and sisters, let us be the one whom Jesus would found to accompany him on his way to Calvary. In his great agony, he sweat blood. Let us lighten his heavy cross by our love, by loving one another and forgiving each other, and by accepting our own sufferings. I wish all of you a fervent and fruitful Lenten season. Thank you and God bless you.